All right, I am joined by Matt Lee. We're just going to jump into it here. And uh, Matt Lee, he's been on the channel before, specialized cybersecurity researcher, also really fun to hang out with and do talks with. But we're here today to talk about Move It. I seen Matt was doing something today about Move It directly contacting companies. He's got one hell of a list because if you haven't heard or if you've been under a rock or it, Move It has been in the news and is a file transfer tool used in the enterprise. I actually have been chatting uh, at the same time, uh, I see Matt Lee talking about this. I was chatting with one of my enterprise friends that they are scrambling and because they use this across their hospitals, <laughs> which yeah. is now yeah. going, oh, no, oh, no. At least they're aware that you don't have to call any of them. Oh, <laughs> uh, well, <laughs> let's start with what is Move It uh, in terms of the vulnerability with it. Let's start there. Yeah. So, I mean, there's a whole host of them, Tom. There's a remote SQL injection, I think. I haven't, I'll be honest with you, I've been so busy in the remediation and explanation and calling and trying to do victim notification, or at least hopefully pre-victim notification of these that I, I haven't dug into it as much as you have, but I know that there has been a slew of them that yes. have come out that make this a very, very easy methodology. And it's been rather exploited, right? We saw Louisiana and, you know, several of other states. So, so others in there and, you know, to catch people up very quickly, it's June 16th and it was only what, like two weeks ago, I think was when the first realization that this was being exploited, which we didn't know there was an exploit in the software. Uh, the exploit was found. And when they said, here's a patch. And then our friends over at Huntress goes, nope, we have another one. We found yet another yes. flaw. Yes. And then, another flaw dropped yesterday oh. so yeah <laughs> accidentally wearing the hunter's shirt accidentally wearing yeah. the hunter's shirt. so there's been just a whole series of flaws this is it not just in the medical facility but used in government agencies and matt lee was actually literally reaching out uh through you can these are publicly exposed so there's ways to discover them if you will we're yes, not going to go yes. into that a uh, methodology but uh, matt has quite the list of government agencies because as they're being actively targeted we wanted to raise some awareness because it's actually easier to make a youtube video and hopefully someone goes yeah, i think we might use that software <laughs> Yeah, 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 exactly. <laughs> yeah, and I'll, and I'll tell you the process, Tom, right? Like I've been, you know, like you said, we won't share exactly the technique because I don't want to make this a lot easier. Yeah. But, you know, we've parsed it through. I got about 60 pages or so of dense, dense, dense URLs. And all of these are active and online. I'm scraping them uh, through a good friend of mine, Cody, that has been doing a lot of this work as well and making the ugly Python script that made the ugly results that I'm parsing through. God bless us all. Yeah. Uh, but it's down and dirty. And it's getting it done. And I'm looking for copyright data that are exposed right and this is one of the things i think move it did poorly that they in their web in their web software it says copyright date 2001 to dash well if that dash is before 2023 and probably quite even presumably if it says 2023 because some of the newer versions don't have any copyright data um we we are seeing that that it's vulnerable and it's up and it's online and so what i'm doing is hitting that page and they have a contact section now to varying degrees it's filled out mostly not uh, and then there's a phone number and so i'm calling and emailing those so if you get an email from me that says critical vulnerability found online here's your site and in it it has a body explaining and linking to the vulnerabilities and then your site link please god take it down yes hack it find some other alternate method to continue doing business and get through this storm as it continues on but yeah that's been what i've been working on now for the last uh, 14 or so hours uh, give yeah or take and, it, and this is why you know i just seen him doing this we were we were chatting because some of the behind the scenes stuff that you know as they participate in the community just like matt lee does uh, we all want to see better outcomes our goal is to raise awareness tell you to patch it or turn it off whichever those options are what you can do person watching this is even if you're just at the help desk of one of these companies and go hey i think we use that suggest whoever the powers may be <laughs> that they should you know point out our video point at several links there's plenty of notices there's plenty of validity and if you happen to see a matt lee email don't ignore it he's not the bad guy he's among the people who are trying to do this that's why i figured a quick video on this topic just to talk about it and uh, leave some comments down below because i think matt wants to put a research project we like to do debriefs on this in the future to talk about what happened because that's how we learn and get better. What could be better, right? Could Maybe be better. having good contact information and a lot of that things, operational systems. I spent three hours on the phone with the police and uh, I think it was Indianapolis and Indy state. And, you know, you have all these things playing out. So yeah, there's so much to, to talk about on this. This will be a very juicy paper that Tom and I might end up doing on stage I, together one day. <laughs> yeah, I think it'll be a fun debrief. So leave your comments down below to remind us that we should come back yeah, and yeah. revisit all of this. Uh, but for now, that's it. Just a uh, 
patch it, you got to move off, move it, <laughs> or move it, move your butt to patch it, Very move it, move sir. it. I just keep on to play that, you know, the song in my hand, move it, move it. <laughs> oh, no. I'm going to have that in my head the rest of the day while I'm making these phone calls. Yeah. Uh, so best of luck to all of you that are tasked with doing this. And uh, thanks. I'll Links down below if you want more information about Matt Lee and all this move it stuff. All right. Thanks.